Well, interesting enough, Andreja is coming to meet Barrett, and we need to talk to Andreja anyway. Hey, Andreja, what's up? I know you have explained it before, but I still do not understand. Yeah, you got jokes. Never would I have imagined to encounter something like the Starborn. Me neither. Now I feel that rather than having answers, we only have more questions. Indeed, it really is incredible, isn't it? Yes, by any meaning of the word. Regardless of how impossible they may have seemed before now, I must say that I do not like being threatened by anyone. Oh no, me neither. Yeah, I took it as less of a threat and more of a warning. It did not sound that way to me, but I suppose we will see which is true. Clearly, the Starborn are connected to the artifacts, which would mean that they are also connected to that temple you found. Sure. Did they make these things? Have they appropriated them? This all implies there is something more, something we do not yet understand. That's true. Yep, if we keep going, I suspect we're going to run into the Starborn again. Yes. Given our first interaction with them, that seems likely. They were actually landed in we Cairo to next be on to our me. Guard from now on, they seem to know much about us. Perhaps we can learn more about them to make it even. We should return to our search then. There's still so much to do. Indeed. So while Andrage is here, uh, are you ready to head back out? Finally, I've been waiting. I could tell Did you're you ready on? to go. I have academic journals to review, and the galaxy's cheesy as hoagie to devour. Yeah, that don't surprise and me. You like giving me cheese. mix of activities. I hope they are both enjoyable. All right, Andreja, so we are now here in Aquila City, as you could tell. Last time we ran into the Charity of the Wolf, and she mentioned getting wheat shipments back underway. I don't exactly know how I can help get those wheat shipments back underway just yet, but we can check in and see how we can provide assistance. I know Aquila City rather well. Perhaps better than I would like. Oh yeah? Had a run in here? Care to elaborate, Andreja? The rock is surprisingly well fortified. The early settlers here were quite practical. Yeah, it looks pretty solid. I mean, if you were to build a fort, so heading down this back alley once more, you, heard of the Elios you retreat? could get lost in this Supposed place. To be some new age oh. healing center for Here we are then, criminals or the West and Filbert's house. Two. So we have to go to Elios, but that's not what we are doing. A good uh, Sarah. person shouldn't let their personal attachments become an obstacle to success. Sure, speaking of if success. If you're here for Weston, he's underfoot somewhere. Either here or at the factory. Oh no, I'm here but to get please, those wheat shipments if going. If they that brewing nonsense, kindly leave. They don't need any more encouragement. Things okay between you and your husband? Dear me, no. Weston's a fine man. If anything, that's why I want more from him. Ah, uh, not living up to he his could potential. Do even greater things. If only he could see that. Right, and that is a say, strange way to say hello. Oh, sorry. My nerves are frayed. So many people coming and going for the company. Weston, that's my husband. Well, he's never been what I'd call a dreamer or a visionary. He's a practical man, good with ledgers and numbers. His brother Henry's the creative one, but he seems to have lost interest in growing the company. And now all he wants to do is brew beer. Could be profitable. Filburn agricultural systems could provide the whole of the settled systems with food, not just Aquila City. Seems those two are content to think small. Right, I see your point. They could be saving some lives. Well, I wish you were the one I had to convince. Well, you didn't come here to hear me natter on. Anything else? Yeah, Amira Wolf at the Low House sent me about the Intello Wheat shipment. <sighs> I know, we're late. It's been this whole frustrating episode. Short version, the farming equipment outside the walls needs to be manually rebooted but the guards aren't going to be able to send people to fix it for days. So that's the guard's We're responsibility? We're helping the unfortunates on the stretch, but the Ashta are just too dangerous for us to send someone. Oh, I've got an Ashta blaster. If it's a simple reboot, I can do that. You would do that? If you get it rebooted, I'll get the harvest going ASAP. We can get the weed to Amira quick. 
I'll talk with my husband, but I'm sure we could arrange payment. You'd be helping our business too, after Profits. all. Profits, indeed. Just, just be careful. Ashta are very dangerous. Luckily, I have a secret weapon. All right, Andresia, get your weapons ready. We're heading out. So what we have here is the Ashta Tamer, which I actually got uh, a little bit ago and put a long barrel on. And uh, hopefully this can do the work against the Ashta, but of course I have my handy dandy eagle uh, in case I need to get up close and personal. Oh jeez, so now there's a caper I, I can help with. I tell you what, running through Aquila City, everyone needs something. Uh, Andresia, don't try this at home. Okay, do ready? Looking from the wall, it seems that a secure bot is over there, but we have three uh, irrigation systems here. I'm sure at Andres will be along shortly. Oh, well, we got a spray. We'll fix that later. All right, Ashta, where you be? We have a few Ashta here. Let's make sure Andreja is nearby. Yes, indeed, ready to go. Let's try out this Ashta Tamer. Woo! Okay. All right. Like a little bit of a grenade launcher. Get out of here. Hey, be careful not to point that thing at me. Sorry. Oh man, it's single load too. All right, full chamber. Hey, are you security or are you a farming bot? Just robot model A. I don't know if you can help us, but it looks like you're already doing some work. All right, let's get in here and reboot this system. Shouldn't be too difficult, I wouldn't say. All right, reboot, please. Cool. And is that it? You're worried about two Ashta. I mean, easiest money I've made today. I mean, we got more damage jumping off the side of the wall than we did getting attacked. There's a sprain so we can get a repairing immobilizer, get our sprain cured, and see what Amira has to say. I don't know if she'll want more money or if she'll have like another random job for me to do. So can we come in this side gate? I mean, pretty intimidating stuff, I must say. Oh, really? Oh, there we go. I was gonna say. Oh man, so uh, you didn't get your paycheck for being a security guard this week, did you? Don't worry, those walls are so. Ain't no Ashta getting in here. Well, I think you got bigger worries than the Ashta. We anyway, Amira. Soon. Oh, you're gonna have the it. Emergency funds empty, so please, that is good, good news. Uh, what was the holdup anyway? They were too lazy to push a button. They had to rebuke, reboot the farming computers. Oh, that makes sense. Aren't they outside the walls? Wait, you went outside the walls, didn't you? Please, don't risk yourself like that. If anyone got hurt working for the low house. Oh, I already did, but I fixed it. I hate to ask it, but this next errand should be safe. Easy. The next errand, Everything eh? Everything runs on charity. And our benefactors, Though kind, I think sometimes, well, get sick of seeing me. A new face may ease up the purse strings, or at least save me some errands. Okay, so uh, who do I talk to? So, the mayor, Elias Cartwright, has always been generous to us, but it's been a while since he's donated. So knock on his door. Marshall Lance is a huge benefactor. Laredo Firearms has been vital for us. Both of those are routine. More polite reminders, really. The last is a long shot, probably futile. But the Trade Authority is incredibly wealthy, and they have never ever donated to us. If you could convince Duncan Lynch to give us anything, heck, a single credit even, I'd consider it a victory. I've got some wine, I'll do my best. You are a breath of fresh air. Once you're done with that, come back to me. All right, so if donations then. Work, all right, so I assume all of these man. donations are going to be here in the city. Cool spacesuit. Yeah, cool uh, underwear. 
So the trade authority is going to be the toughest nut to crack. So we'll take care of the other two quick, fast, and in a hurry. And then if we have to, we have some Merlot we can chug before we uh, speak to the trade authority. And if she's happy with a single coin, we're not going to try to have them break the bank. Just a little starter donation so they get the warm and fuzzies. All right, so there's the trade authority there. And down here, is this Laredo? Yes, Laredo Firearms. And they may have some cool weapons for us as well. Uh-huh, uh-huh, display so we models. We've seen a few of these, although Why that, I'm not exactly, not uh... Much use. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. you. But you know, stretch trash will come back and loiter, or worse. Let them. A few beer bottles and graffiti is the least we owe them. Speaking of yes. O, Raisha. I think you'll find that we carry fine weapons of all kinds here. I'm here to ask for donations for the Low House. Oh. So Amira has some help? Good. She's going to work herself into an early grave if she's not careful. Yeah, I feel that. Rado Firearms prides itself in helping out all the residents of Aquila City. I'll send Justin over to deliver our monthly donation. That would be much appreciated. You are quite welcome. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Yeah, let's take a look at your selection. Yes, of course. You know, so while we're here, we could pick up all of the ammo. I mean, why not? We're already here, you know. So it looks like their prime selection, with the pun intended, is the prime pistol, 88 physical damage, and randomly deals corrosive radiation poison or incendiary damage. Pretty solid pistol. We, ha we have the credits to spend, but I don't know, you know, our stuff's doing the work. I don't necessarily need this. And the next gentle hey, reminder will be right back. up here. Interesting, okay. Kind of an open air situation. Hello there, so good to see you. You too, Elias. Good to meet you, friend. Name's Elias Cartwright. I'm the mayor of Aquila City. Now, I've got a memory for faces, and I can't say I've seen yours around here before. No, but you I'd might have heard of me. I'd introduce myself to everyone who passes through our fine city. As the founder himself once said, there's no substitute for a warm welcome and a friendly smile. I prefer that, thanks. You're more than welcome. As I'm sure you know, us folk in the Free Star Collective put great stock in human kindness and generosity of spirit. I like to think that's what sets us apart from our neighbors in the United Colonies. Yeah, I we can don't see that. rely on machines or bureaucracy. We rely on each other. I won't pry about what brought you here. That's all of your business and none of mine. However, I'd be more than happy to give you the scoop about the core and Midtown. Yeah, I'm actually here to ask for donations, though. What day is it? Oh, shoot. I forgot. I'll send over my usual monthly donation to Amira. She truly is a wonder. And with the building project her and Mr. Tate are planning, there may be a day when the stretch is a distant memory. Ah, building project, eh? Blowhouse appreciates it. I'll talk with Amira later. I didn't mean to cause any problems. Between thwarting bank robberies and helping the stretch, you have the city's thanks. Truly. So you have heard of me. So last up, the Trade Authority and I have wine at the ready, excuse me, coming through, citizen. Hello, hope you don't mind if I just take a quick swig. Yeah, some Chandra Malbec. Might not be too bad. The Trade Authority looks to partner with local governments to find mutually beneficial arrangements. Ah, funny you mention that. Welcome to Aquila City's Trade Authority. I'm here to ask for donations. The Trade Authority has a firm policy of not getting involved in internal... Hey, what was all that crap about the We're Trade Authority in seeks to... Of the governments of the Free Star Collective and the United Colonies. That's not what you just said. Surely you can spare something to help the needy. Sorry. I dutifully follow the policies laid out by the Trade Authority. I'm done discussing this matter. I actually met a guy who finished the Red Mile. He lost an eye in the process, but he did walk away with a pile of credits. And I mean, you got two eyes, right? 
Oh, the Red Mile. Something else to check out. Thank you, scantily clad security guard. I tell you, you're the MVP today. All right, Amira. Talk to everyone. Elias and Raisha both sent their donations. Thank you. No word from the Trade Authority. I'm sorry I even asked. Yeah, that guy's a I little like bit snob. I like to believe snob. everyone is capable of empathy and compassion, but people like Duncan test my faith. Yeah, he is a pretty insufferable jerk. I didn't say that, but I'm not going to correct you. Sarah Philborn gave me these credits to give to you for your help with the farm. You more than deserve it. And, uh, you don't need any more help then? Not so fast. I have one more thing for you to do. But I hope it's more of a reward. Okay. This is part of the Intelliweed Harvest. I'd like you to deliver it to Simone Jansen and her family. I want you to see the fruits of your labors. Sure! Oh, that's a nice payday for jumping over the wall and nearly breaking a leg. And luckily, our destination is not that far away, just down the street. Special delivery! Amira said to expect you. This wheat ensures my family won't go to bed hungry. I, I genuinely don't know what my family would do without Amira. And uh, you... You have no idea how much it means. No, I don't, because you're not really looking at me. But just glad to lend a little hand. Over here in Aquila, it's humbling to see regular people just looking after us. On behalf of my family, of my daughter, bless you. All right, charity of the wolf complete. And uh, yeah, now I can see how happy you are. And it seems this red mile might be lucrative and interesting she has my attention saying hey you've got two good eyes surely you don't need one of them uh sounds dangerous and that's uh something that i'm actually in uh, the yes, mood for Eddie. today all right course set for porima it looks like we are on our horse and to the frozen wastes of the red mile set course for porima three and uh, let's get to it. All right, we haven't actually scanned Porima 3 just yet. Got that scan done. Ooh, marginal flora, fauna, and some resources and a planetary feature. So this might be good to uh, get paid with. So minus 18 and double the gravity here. Yeah, we're uh, our legs are gonna be a little bit taxed here, but we are here at the red mile. Not sure what to expect, as it were. So I, uh, I assume there's a front door to this place, Don't right? Don't step or the rangers will help you if you get into trouble out here. Oh, that's a cool voice filter. Play by the house rules, or you'll find yourself on the other side of an airlock without a helmet. Duly noted. It's still a bit more legal now, I suppose, but hardly more civilized. So we'll, uh... We'll just step through the door then, you shall I, sir? To the other side of my boat if you keep trying to strike up a conversation. Sorry. Dare to run for fame, glory, and life. Okay. Bullshit. You didn't think we'd notice that you tried to slip away without paying your check? A gambling debt? I was just going out for some fresh air. I even told the bartender. You can ask her yourself. Fresh air, huh? on a planet with no atmosphere. That's enough, Stalker. Lower your weapon. We don't shoot guests over a misunderstanding. Well, I'm, that's good. Sir, Standards and all that. to your table. It's bad practice to leave our establishment without paying your bill first. If you need some fresh air, pay up, go outside, and come back in and start a new check when you're ready. I'm sorry, but I didn't think it would be a problem. You That's the problem wrong. you didn't think. Dead wrong. That's enough. I think the gentleman understands. Now let's all go back inside, shall we? And Stalker, you and I are going to talk about this later. I can't wait. Unless you want to be on my bad side, you better back off. Okay. 
So nice that they give the runners some nutrition before they go. Maybe a, uh, a power bar or something. Ooh. You know, Neon was a nice place, but this one certainly isn't bad either. Touch screen to learn more. The leaderboard. Top five Red Mile runners. Donovan Reese has 28 successful runs. Holy crap on a cracker. What, what constitutes one run? Jeez, how much money flows through here. Although they're breaking the number one rule of casinos, and that is don't have any windows that lets you know how long you've been sitting in here. Jeez, it looks like these people can learn a thing or two from me. 